please do not rescue like this guys if the bar is more than a half it's better for you to wait for a bit it happens a lot on rank matches recently if you're not sure that you can make it on time it's better for you to wait for a bit wait for the second rescue it's better and you also can maybe use the perfume on the right timing as well and it's not only happened for one time but so many times and i feel really bad because it happens mostly to blubber you know oh my god it happens so many times hi guys welcome back to gaita gaming <laughs> As you can see on the intro, this video will gonna highlight how you rescue if the bar is going to reach half bar. It's better for you to wait for a bit. Why? Because every second matters a lot if you wanna win in your rank matches. I'm not gonna lie here, every second matters a lot. Don't worry, me and Blubber will gonna support you no matter what. I mean, even though when someone down early in the beginning let's say because some mistake or let's say because of the ping issue we'll, we'll not gonna spam thank you to you because we believe that if you want to win on survival rank match you need a good teamwork and you need to keep up the mood of the players as well so let's just support each other and that's also the reason why i started to play rank matches again after like around a month like around a month i stopped playing rank matches and then after ada can be used on rank i started to play as her and i really really love it because i can be a kiter and also a good support for the whole team and i'm gonna show it to you as well on this video so as you can see here blubber couple times play as forward on my recent videos and this is also the reason why because when blubber being the rescuer being the rescuer to rescue the other players i can support him too or let's say i can support the victim after blubber rescuing them okay so it's a clean rescue maximizing the titaner persona remember maximizing the titaner persona like i told you before okay so blubber can go for the second rescue let the titaner work why because if you are way too close with a hunter for the first rescue if someone down way too early hunter will be very happy they're gonna hit you as well and you are injured so now blubber is on full health condition he can go for the second rescue well he got the wanted order you know the red highlight from the hunter persona so bloody queen know where's the location of blubber and wanna try to hit him immediately to re rescue mechanic right away okay so as you can see here blubber is trying trying to stop bloody queen chasing mechanic by stunning her okay so bloody queen took down blubber because <laughs> she got really annoying with blubber i guess and the good thing is like i told you before hunter might lose the first victim and that's the right timing for me to heal the mechanic with my skill so now the mechanic is on full health condition again okay so blubber sit on the chair again and this is when the situation gone quite wrong i mean like bloody queen is chasing the cypher machine she knew there is a bot here and hit the bot and the mechanic should go right away actually to blubber chair well or at least barmaid need to go right away because they are the closest one i am way too far with the location of the rocket chair and the timing is also really bad which is more than half like one millimeter more than half and i feel really bad because blueberry is screaming on voice call to me because it happens a lot to him like recently and i'm sorry that my ping really went so wrong on this match to be honest with you and i didn't know why it give a bad impact to my safe replay as well so as you can see here blueberry is on full health condition it's as simple as because i send my blood to him right away because we need to help this mechanic no matter what because the mechanic will gonna die after this we need to buy more time for us to decode we still have two cypher left and blubber will gonna help the mechanic here no matter what and that's also the reason why i send my blood to him so on full health condition it will be easier for him to harass the hunter but then suddenly yep bloody queen changed the trade from bling to excitement and hit blubber right away oh no this is not good at all so mechanic will gonna die after this and the cypher is almost prime can we make it or no oh my god 
we cannot make it at this moment oh no so this is the reason why guys rescuing rescuing like i told you before if you're not sure that you can reach it before half then wait for a bit because if blubber can sit after this for the second time i'm gonna wait for barmaid to rescue him first so we could have a better chance let's say for a win or let's say a better chance for a draw on this situation i was just sending my notification to barmaid that the dungeon is here and hoping that one of us can go to the dungeon let's say i'm not sure if bloody queen still chasing her or no because i saw that she is using the speed bottle before i am going to the other exit gate to try to open the exit gate i know that bloody queen has changed the trait to excitement right you know to prevent blubber rescuing mechanic and that's also the reason why she cannot teleport she only can rely herself with the mirror image so can we make it open the exit gate and go together to the exit gate near the ship oh my god bloody queen now gonna go to the middle map and using the mirror image to get any of us but i have managed to open the exit gate and barmaid is coming to my exit gate too Whew, we can secure a draw which is pretty nice so that's the tips for today remember guys rescuing timing is really important if you're not sure you can make it before half just wait for it wait for the second rescue we will appreciate it more okay so i'm gonna play more as ada on my rank matches and i hope that you're gonna still enjoying my video guys this is very awesome in terms of kiting and also supporting friends from far away okay so i guess that's all for today's video guys i see you again on my next video bye bye